Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I did a cleanse, makeup application, and hair. So what you just saw me use was the Clean and Clear Lemon Towelettes to cleanse my face before applying anything. And that's the 111 Skin, the Cryo Activating Gel. It's really good, you guys. I love it. It makes your skin feel so watery and moist and plump. Then I use the Hey Honey Take Away the Drama Youth Boosting Honey and Copper Peel Off Mask. Um, this definitely left my skin feeling very pure and um, it didn't dry it out. So the exfoliation was real with this mask. Don't forget to moisturize before using it. Moisturizer then the mask. After, I used the Too Faced Hangover Good in Bed Hydrating Serum. Awesome. <laughs> and then the No Problem Primer. And this was my first time using this primer. I actually got it in an Ipsy uh, bag, Ipsy box. And it was pretty dope. So I didn't use the Fenty, I only used the Anastasia 490W, so that's what you see there. And blending it in with my um, blender sponge that I got from Fierte Cosmetics, um, which is a brand I learned about on Instagram. Beautiful palette. Blend, blend, blend. And that is the NARS concealer. I'm just adding a little dimension there. That one is the Dark 3 in Dark Coffee. Taking that nose in a little. And just chiseling it up just a bit so I'm using my sponge with this because I love the way that it just makes it melt into your skin anything you use with these sponges your skin just melts into the product it's just melts into your skin and that is the NARS concealer also that one is the medium dark 3 I think it's like Amande is the color and then there I'm using the Morphe um, brush I forgot which one but it's with the Anastasia dip brow in dark brown And just kind of speeding through that. I mean, I'm sure you seen me do my brows plenty of times. Ta-da! <laughs> and I'm baking with the Sasha um, loose powder in Buttercup. And that's also the NARS concealer that I just used on my lids. Blend it in, blend it in. And it might not look like it, but I baked for a while. <laughs> look at those cheekbones, you guys. Look at those cheekbones. And that is the Meat Matrimony Palette by The Balm Cosmetics. That also came in my Ipsy January box. I showed this palette in my previous video with my uh, Ipsy unboxing for January. And 
I'm using the Huda Beauty Sapphire Obsessions right now. This palette is beautiful. I got this one and the Emerald Obsessions in that box and I am so pleased. I can't wait to do a look using the Emerald. Can't wait. And just blending it out, blending it out. And that was the P. Louise uh, base in five. Yeah, rumor five, number five. And this base is so dope, you guys. Like, oh, it just spreads seamlessly, effortlessly. But it still leaves, I don't know how to describe it, like a tackiness to it for the product to latch onto. But not, not in a messy way. Like This is a great base. I love everything that I've gotten from P. Louise so far. I mean, so far, the brand can do no wrong. So as far as the eyeshadow, everything thus far after using the Matrimony palette is the um, Sapphire Obsessions. As you can see, that's what I'm holding in my hand using the mirror. <laughs> and I used a little bit of the base on my lower lid the P. Louise base and that's the Kat Von D tattoo liner just did a little wing I didn't go all crazy and go out just a little one I liked it though it came out really cute And that's the Kaleido Cosmetics highlighter. This highlighter is so pretty. I wish you could see it in person. Swinging hair lashes. I got these off of Instagram. And I trimmed them off camera. You'll see. Bam. See? Trimmed. <laughs> That's the Maybelline Mega Value Mascara and the Morphe, um, blah, 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 blah. The Morphe, uh, bronzer in Romance. So I'm contouring with that. That is a really pretty bronzer. I love this bronzer. And, um, I'm definitely going to buy a couple of them because I'll be using those from now on. That's my favorite bronzer right now. And then the MAC blush. Um, that one was a mineralized blush. And the color, yikes. I don't know, you guys. But that's the P. Louise highlighter. What did I say, guys? No wrong, right? Like, for real. No wrong. That highlighter is called Glow For Me Baby. And I didn't see this on the website. This was something that they just gave me extra when they sent my uh, my PR package. Wait, did it come with that? I think it came with that. Um, my MAC lip liner. And I forgot. And that's the NARS concealer right there I'm using on my lips, you guys. Doesn't it look pretty, that brown? And then I threw the Morphe gloss over the top of it. And that gloss is called Free Bird. And duh, the Hangover 3-in-1 Primer and Setting Spray. The Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. You know you gotta spray your sleigh. And... 
there I was looking like a wild child. So the replenishing water drops and the argon oil serum is what I use on this hair and it brings me back every time brings me all the way back like look at this look at this who does she think she is like coming with these water waves like this and then I threw some Cantu gel I didn't use that brush I that that one right there the green and white one that's my old faithful and she does a great job so we reverted back to her because she's awesome so I'm getting my baby hair is popping and ta-da, finished look. Let me know what you think guys and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.